Hi people, it's your boy Awan Kenneth and welcome to my YouTube channel. So today, I want to talk about something that has been on my mind for like 5 seconds, right? And before we go on, subscribe to the channel, right? So, there's this thing YouTube, Nigeria, is fun of doing. And basically, it's what um, marketers, ad agencies and promoters basically are fond of doing when it comes to events and programs in Nigeria. So they do this funny thing where they consider Lagos as the entirety of Nigeria and anywhere else is just on their own and the only place they consider apart from Lagos would be the outskirts of Lagos like Ibadan or some nearby states that's one which really don't get much things to be like, to be fair apart from like alcohol events and some stuff concerts then the other one is Abuja so basically they remember the president lives there and small politics is there so they have to just go pay homage to that city or anywhere else, like just for example, Potakot is trying, Enugu has Igbo money, um, Northern parts, um, Zamfara, Borno, all those places are like <laughs> they're on their own, except if they develop their own money or their own things, nobody is ever going to come down to them apart from NGOs. So now, YouTube has this thing where they do lots of cool events. And I feel like there are a lot more successful YouTubers that are not based in Lagos and Abuja. For example, that should have invites to these events. I don't know if they invite them or and those YouTubers decline, but I don't think you'll be doing events almost consecutively every year and people will be declining from other states, right? So like right now they have an event going on and from what I've seen on Instagram the people that are there are just mostly Lugosians and it's more of actors and musicians than YouTubers to be honest but yeah, yeah those celebrities now have their YouTube channel so I understand but then again you hardly see people from the example Plateau State I know of a very cool guy that has some I think almost 50,000 subscribers. I hardly see him being invited to those kind of things. Although he has said he has been invited once. But I think YouTube doesn't pay for like transport, um, accommodation and stuff. So it's a lot more harder. But I don't know. This is not like... It's just me just pointing out something and I'm like, what could be done? Because if you're doing all those events, they are growing that place. It's cool, it's fine, yeah? Focus on one place and gory, right? But as the setting point, also invite people along or try to like get one person just... Like I said, even if it's only one person that gets to go from these outside places, at least it's a lot of motivation for the rest of us to feel like, okay, yeah, they care about us and we are happy, right? That's like the point of this video. So, I don't know if YouTube if you managed to see this from my small YouTuber account. Think about it. Anyway, bye guys. Remember to love yourself.